Welcome back to Info Squad, where information equals freedom. Right now, your phone probably says 4G LTE in the top corner of your screen. Soon that will change to 5G. This is a new advancement in wireless communications, but 5G is different than anything we've had up until now. 2G, 3G, 4G, 4G LTE, and now 5G. What does it mean? Well, to put it simply, the G stands for generation, as in the next generation of wireless technologies. Each generation is supposedly faster, more reliable, and more secure, but it is also more invasive. The goal of the new 5G rollout is to create the Internet of Things. A goal to create a nightmarish control grid where everything you can imagine will be chipped and tracked, including you. This is going to be a massive blanket control of everything and the monitoring of everyone. The Internet of Things is a term coined by Kevin Ashton of Procter and Gamble in 1999. And 20 years later, this prediction will become a reality. 5G Networks is referring to the high frequency band between 30 gigahertz and 300 gigahertz in what we call the millimeter wave spectrum. These waves will be incredibly faster but will not travel as far. This is why you're going to see more antennas to accompany this new 5G wireless network. And when we say more antennas, we mean tons more. They will have to do this to achieve the same coverage as the 4G networks currently have. As of right now, the projected widespread release of this technology is the year 2020. There is a considerable concern among people that the 5G system will potentially become weaponized. This is a claim that should not be taken lightly as the military currently uses similar frequency bands in its active denial system. This is a weapon system that uses the mix of microwave and millimeter waves to heat up a certain target. This weapon can be used in non-lethal and lethal capacities. It's not hard to imagine a situation where hackers or other nefarious parties gain control of the system and potentially use it in a harmful way. We can all agree on faster download speeds and a better connection. But at what cost are we willing to obtain these goals? Hey guys, thanks for watching. Leave us a comment down below. If you like what we're doing here at Info Squad, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and we'll catch you in the next video.